Yo, what is going on, you guys? Pause. This is post editing Angry Cole, and if you guys know this video even a little bit, a thumbs up is greatly appreciated because this took a long time to edit. I think after editing this video, I don't ever want to hear King Crimson again. I'm a bit off more than I could chew editing this video, but you know, I went ahead and pulled through for you guys, so I hope you guys enjoy it. Right, today, I have a pretty cool idea for Xenoverse. Now, if you have been watching JoJo Part 5 like I've been, and you don't want to be spoiled, um, I'm just going to be talking about a stand name and what it does. Nothing too crazy like as a big spoiler but if that bothers you you have been warned so today we're going to be playing with hit awoken and basically going to be cosplaying as the stand king crimson um and the reason why i chose it is because you know king crimson has the stand ability to erase time or basically time skip in a way so yeah well, i've changed up his colors to kind of like king crimson you know you can't change his skin color or anything like that so that's a little bit unfortunate and you can't change that like navy blue um but it's kind of close because you know king crimson is uh like maroon and silver not silver but like gray something like that so yeah, we've given hit phantom fist time skip flash skewer time skip backbreaker time skip jump spike um the dual time skip molotov isn't going to happen because i'm not doing 2v2s and i'm not playing with the cpu and we're going to be using time skip molotov pure progress and time skip tremor pulse so yeah we're going to play some with limitations because um we'll do with and without it doesn't really matter um and yeah we're just going to see how well we do there may not be any commentary in the matches because i want to kind of whenever i land a time skip move I want to skip that part of the video, which I think is going to be pretty interesting and a little bit funny. So if I land a time skip move, you guys won't see it happen. You'll just be like, whoa, he just took damage, which I think would be pretty cool. And I also might throw in the King Crimson time erase sound effect or whatever. Still not too sure on what it does, but I got kind of a good idea. So yeah, let's go and hop to the right match and see how well we do. And yeah. All right, you guys, we have found our first opponent. This time I decided to just go ahead and leave in the commentary. I don't see it as that big of a deal. That would have been perfect time to use back. That was a pretty good use of Atherman Strike. Oh, I forgot that knocks you away. Oh my god, the damage. Oh, come on. There we go. Finally. <laughs> it's been so long since I played his hit and my dog is barking in the background. We really outplayed that guy. He used to limp first. He was really trying to win. I'm glad we won. GG. Alright, you guys. We have found our next opponent. We're going against another variation of Goku. This time we're going against the uh, Resurrection of F Goku. That's what you call that variation. Hello? Wow, I just walked into that. Kick. 
Very nice. Really hate that helicopter. I got hit by that still. Um, I feel like that guy kind of gave up towards the end. I don't even know, but GG. We're going against another Mare Earthling, and if you guys haven't seen my latest Xenoverse video with XY, uh, let's see what happens. And I just walk into that. The guy's a Mel Earthling and he has 666 in his gamer tag. That's understandable. Okay, oh shit. Oh shit. Okay, I gotta commit him though. It's been about 30 seconds and he hasn't done an XY yet. Okay, ill flash. I really hate that move. I'm scared you gotta be to fight me only when your ill flash is in the air. Oh, that's pretty sweet. So if I hit a, use a time skip move whenever he does a flash, it's basically pointless. Oh, now I need super armor. King Crimson's ability. Damn, GG. GG, you limit bursting, ill flash spamming, justice combination using Mel Earthling. Alright, I forgot to mention that, that Mel Earthling, even though he did justice combination to me, limit burst, and spam ill flash the whole game, there's something he didn't do, which was use XY. Can I just get a moment of silence for that? Got his note out there? I need to get some fan fist off. My fan fist, I used to be so good with it, but I haven't used it in so long. I almost walked into a stun break. There you go. At the end. King Crimson no Norikuda. I know it looks like I'm grass spamming, but I'm just doing it for the video. Well, you wouldn't even be able to see the grab. It's getting invasive off.
now he little boosts you. Okay, that damage though. GG, that was a little close. Um, I got a little cocky. I was every time he caught me to combo, I just wanted to time skip the hell out of that dude, and I did. GG, he almost caught me off guard with that limit burst because I thought it only boosts sort of hopes attack, but that shit gave him like an extra boost to all his attacks. So GG. All right, you guys, we have found our next opponent. This is the same guy who's playing as Super Saiyan 4 Goku, I believe. Except now he's his creator character. He's a legendary Super Saiyan. You know what, this reminds me of uh, it's a uh, color variation in the fighter. It's kind of dumb to attack him, but I did anyway. King Crimson no Norik da. I can't grab while being hit, that's just not even smart. <laughs> Command Ma would have still hit me, I would have died. Why'd I stop attacking? Why'd that back hit me? I want to turn pure progress, but I know it's not going to help. I knew he was going to limit burst. GG, I had to beat the shit out of that man. Woo! Because that's the second time I played him and he limit bursted. And I got that comeback. So I'm pretty happy. GG, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like for more, subscribe for more, comment down below, let me know what you guys think. And yeah, I hope you guys all have a wonderful day. Peace.